Hello and welcome to Atomic Heart. I'm Shadow Coast and welcome to the channel. In this video, we're going to outline how to defeat Ploosh, which is another boss fight. So, you have one of these things before you go in, and I highly recommend that you just move all of your ammo and guns over because they're not going to do much for you in this fight. He is resistant to firearms, but. I do believe he is weak to fire, so we're going to actually get two canisters, just you, know, you have to remember that we're going to have to load this back in. I'm going to go bring um, a few items here. Let's go ahead and in looking, oh there we go, there's my third canister. Um, what else do I want to bring? Can I stack five? We got the large. We can. All right. Authorization, Major. Hold on, I'm just uh, making sure. Why well, won't it let me? Oh, there it goes. There's the little ones. I was wondering where the so, little heels were. Will it be major? Okay, Weapons so or... a couple, a couple items here. When you think about your upgrades for your character, very important you have bulwarks. So if you have to ref refund certain abilities, I do recommend that you build out to make sure you have bulwark. Um, the other one that you're going to want is second win. Additional dodge will be critical. Now I personally like frostbite and where is it? Polymeric jet sprays target. Let's see, um, increases the maximum range, yeah. So we're gonna try to freeze and then hit him. Now when we're talking about weapons here, you can see I have the ax, obviously. The if you speed. want or have other melee weapons, that's fine. I'm just gonna do it with the ax, because A, that's what I have, that's what I've upgraded. Just so you guys can see for upgrades, I do have crushing blue. However, what I'm going to actually end up doing here is I'm gonna switch to um, powerful blow. So when you remove an upgrade, you get the resources back. So yes, I want all my resources back. So I'm actually going to upgrade crushing blow. Um, I feel like I feel like that might be a mistake. It says we should get all the resources back, but I'm I had it upgraded more. So crushing blow overhead so before we go down here i'm going to go ahead and install flame we're going to kick off this battle let's What's grab this thing canisters be careful that is a specimen called plush or plush ivy it is extremely dangerous how yeah, to defeat ivy plush and of course the ripped off arm is in there so you too. can see Why vulnerable to fire somewhere all right so we're gonna oh, we're, so he's gonna have a, a charge ability, which is um, what we're gonna try to avoid. You can see the overhand as long as we land it is actually good. Oh boy, that's where we want to do the double jump. So he's gonna uh, attack you. I'm playing on mouse and keyboard, and you're gonna have to click certain buttons. So just be aware that there's certain buttons you're going to click and here we're going to have to do a little uh, tapping of the button to get him off of us and then when we do now is a perfect time to shock hit him with whatever you have just make sure you're double dodging back I, I have um, the charge up I'm going to charge just be um, aware that his kind of jump this is why you need your double dodge oh man that timed it wrong it is tough and we can just kind of regular swing at him too so let's get some jets on he is a shifty one um, we 
We can also shock him, but it's not going to do quite as much damage. The flame damage is really critical. And then, of course, here, we got to click this again. Just uh, being ready to click different buttons. Once you get three, get ready to tap. So we're going to tap E in this case on the um, controller. I'm assuming it's kind of any button. We're going to go ahead and take a beat to heal. Oh boy, man, he guys like infinite range here, which is annoying. I'm just trying to slow him down. Oh, I was not charging up my axe. Ah, let's take a bite out of him. Oh boy. It's close range. Melee. Trying to dodge out of his. Um... Oh, he's got a good range on that thing. We're going to keep dodging and healing here. I'm gonna dodge left to right on that. Oh boy, you got us. You did a good job. All right, get ready. We're gonna mash some buttons. Um, go, 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 go. Coming off of this, we're gonna polymerize him. Let's get up close and personal. All right, let's heal. Come on. You should really be sure. Oh, boy. Okay, so what we're gonna do now, we're gonna work on installing our next, um, so right now I should be charging, and that is how you kill that Ivy Poosh. Almost took me out. He's a Let's tough hope one. one of those freaks doesn't come crawling out of the next canister. According and hopefully you found this video helpful. So just as a recap, make sure when you're upgrading Make sure when you're upgrading that um, you have your double dodge, your physical resistance, you have a melee weapon, and highly recommend you bringing some fire cartridges attaching them to your melee weapon. If you found this video helpful, please drop a thumbs up and hope to see you in future videos. And just don't forget to re-kit yourself up uh, when you leave. Proceed because you want to have all your fun goodies ready to go um, when you're back out in the field. So I'm a big shotgun user here, at least for this playthrough. Um, that's a quip. We'll put this back. All right. Hope to see you in future videos. Shadow Coast out.